the East Sea Expedition team decided to go to Ulungdo from Mukho Port. The members decided to follow the journey made by the Sutosa who departed from Tepuhon. Fabian said he really looked forward to going to Ulungdo in the East Sea. Um, this is actually my third time here in Ulungdo and also third time in Dokdo. So I think this trip was a little bit different because I came here with uh, uh, friends and I don't know, I had a lot of expectations. Yeah, because really cool. if the weather is not good, you can't <laughs> actually go on the island. You're not able to go on the island if the weather is not good. You have like maybe 50, year, 50 days a year. Mm -hmm. Oh, really? Yeah. yeah, the two islands, they are like the most like famous thing in the East Sea. Really? Yeah, yeah. Mm -hmm. Longdo and Dokdo. The most, the furthest, part, the furthest place east mm -hmm. in Korea that you oh, can go. Yeah, yeah. Interesting. You can't go any further east. Yeah. Wow. <laughs> It's great to see the clear blue skies and calm waves. That made the team's visit to Ulungdo Island more enjoyable. weather! So that's Ulung, yeah? Ulungdo is a volcanic island located in the East Sea of Korea. This island is the sole sea route to Dokdo. Ulungdo is a beautiful place with natural and picturesque scenery. Dodonghang is the gateway to Ulungdo and is the sole port in the East Sea. The first thing the members caught sight of at Todong Port is the freshly caught seafood at the market stalls. The Ulungdo squid is very popular and is well loved all over the nation for its taste and quality. Few hours. Just caught it? Yeah, I think they just caught it. Like few hours. The members tried the delicacy with the stunning backdrop surrounding them. We're sure the members are probably thinking, good thing we came to Ulungdo. The Hengnam Esplanade is a coastal walk path around Ulungdo. The Hengnam Esplanade is a 2.6 kilometer walk connecting the Dodong Port to the Chodong Port. This is a must visit spot in Ulungdo where everyone can fall in love with the emerald-colored waters of the East Sea. <laughs> What's that? Who is it? Looks like some volcano stuff. Igneous rock, can you? Well, it's cool because you know that. Hello,安迪。Hello,安迪。Hello,安迪。Hello,安迪。Hello,安迪。Hello,安迪。Hello,安迪。Hello,安迪。Hello,安迪。Hello,安迪。Hello,安迪。Hello,安迪。Hello,
치루도처럼 이렇게 만들어진 어느 돌이 되겠습니다. 그래서 이건 지질학적으로 이야기를 해서 이그님 브라이트라고 그렇게 이야기를 하는 거죠. 그럼 쉽게 네. 말하면 어릉도라는 자체가 화산이었어요? 그렇습니다. 우리나라에서 가장 대표적인 화산섬이 됩니다. 독도하고 울릉도 그리고 저 멀리 있는 제주도 이세개 섬이 우리나라에서 가장 대표적인 화산섬이라고 얘기할 수가 있죠. 그 독도 보인다고 했었잖아요. 네. 그 언제 보여요? 방향으로 보면 저 방향, 저 멀리 배가 있는 방향 쪽이 이 독도가 되겠습니다. 아, 네, 선생님 감사합니다. 감사합니다. 네, 감사합니다. 네, 잘 들었습니다. 좋은 구경 많이 하고 가십시오. 네, 네, 네 감사합니다. 네. 네. The team headed over to the spot where Tokto can be seen. Will they be able to see the island from here? 세종신록 진리시. Yeah, mm -hmm. it's uh, you know, it's a. Uh, from which time is it? Like Joseon. Yeah, Joseon it's from times. Joseon Dynasty. Oh. It's like actually the record from the king. Uh -huh. And in this book, they say you can see Tokto like. From this spot here, actually. Really? Yeah, when okay. the weather is good, so the uh, weather is not that far from here. So they say you can see Tokdo like from this spot here. The geography section of the annals of King Sejong's reign was completed in 1454 in the Joseon dynasty over a time span of three decades. The two islands, Usan and Burung, are located in the center of the sea. The two islands aren't far apart from one another and are visible on a clear day. In the old days, Sutosa left Daepunghon in Uljin and entered Ulungdo. We're sure they probably caught sight of this beautiful landscape and probably saw Tokdo. The members received an unexpected present while they were out on the esplanade. The members went up to the Manmulsang observation platform, a place where visitors can take in 10,000 different picturesque landscapes. I'm in California right now. Yeah. I think, guys, if you, what I want to make a wish. Wow. wow. I don't know. I think, I think the, you know, on the East Sea, there's, there's so many different facets to it. I mean, what we've seen prior to coming to Ulungdo and then coming here and, and seeing different sides of it as yeah. well. Yeah. I know. Well, and, and here in Korea. Experience, have different experiences, yes. even if it's the same place. Yeah, yes. exactly. And you have a different outlook on it. So, mm -hmm. you know, I think it's a, it's going to be fun, one way or another. Sure. High five. <laughs> that was great. <laughs> Look that at that. It was that. so fast. That, that, just oh, so that is beautiful. I wow. actually this think is that is, is probably a one of the best views I've seen. Look yes. at look at this right here though. This the rock sense. landscape with the waves crashing on the rocks. This is better than California. The East Sea Expedition team heard about a famous grandmother in Ulungdo. Someone who's as famous as the island's governor. They couldn't wait to meet her. The oldest diver, right? All ages all together. Really? Right, right? What are you talking about? There's five of us. Okay. It's pretty. Grandmother Kim Hwa Soon has been a female diver since her teenage years until she passed the age of 90. She's an expert who knows the underwater life of the East Sea better than anyone else. She naturally learned to dive as she lived right by the seashore. She had to dive to earn money and couldn't part ways with the ocean for a time period of 80 years. <laughs> The guys couldn't come empty-handed. 
추우니까 <웃음> 따뜻하게 하시라고 아. 이게 예쁠 것 같아요. 그 아유 민요. 네. 아우 잘 어울리신데. 네. 아이고. 할머니 응? 많이 춥죠? 아, 추워? 추 할머니 추우세요? 많이 추워요? 추워? 네. 아, 안 추워. 아, 아 이거 이거 때문에 안 추우세요. 안 추우세요. 아, 네. 아, 그러시구나. 아, 안, 안 따뜻해요? 어. 좋아. 아, 좋아. 좋아요? 아, 음. 좋아요. 우리 먼저 갈게요. 네, 피곤하시니까. 네. 아니, 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 있으세요. 네. 있어요. 아, 여기, 계세요. 아, 여기, 여기, 여기 계세요. 여기 계세요. 네, 그 할머니. 아이고, 한, 한, 한 가요. 네, 먼저 네. 가면 네. 건강하세요, 할머니. 감사해요. 네, 우리 감사하세요. 네, 건강하세요. 네. 안녕하세요. 또 보러 올게요, 네. 할머니. 네. 뭐줄 것도 없고. 아, 괜찮아요. 아, 아, 괜찮습니다. 괜찮아요. 충분히 줄건 만남이었으니까. 말 다른 다. 감사합니다. 네. 만수 무강하세요. 네. 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 할머니. 네. 건강하세요. 네. 건강하세요. 네. 네. 건강하세요. 네. 감사합니다, 할머니. 갑시다. 예. 할머니, 같이 아, 예. 우리 어머 우리 할머니도 한국 사람이요. 아? 우리 할머니, 우리 할머니. 이거 이거 우리 한국 사람이다. 네. 티비는. 네, 우리 엄마도 한국 사람. 한국 사람. 네. 음. 그래서 나중에 저 여기 다시 와서 요리 해드릴게요. 어, 아, 우리 우리 한국이구나. 네. 그래서 이 사람들도 잘하고 말도 잘한대. 나중에 꼭. Dario's half Korean, and he's very attached to his maternal grandmother. Does he see a resemblance between his granny and grandmother Kim Hwa Sun? He had a tough time saying goodbye to her. If I come to Ulongdo again, I'm sure I should visit her. Um, I hope she will be healthy and still healthy at this time. Uh, who knows? The East Sea Expedition Team is on a mission, a mission to fully comprehend and see the beauty of the East Sea. They're on a 10-day journey from Yangyang in Gangwon-do to the beautiful port city of Busan. The five guys are on a quest to unveil the hidden stories of the East Sea. The East Sea is alive in Korean history and in the lives of the Koreans. The members of the East Sea Expedition are enjoying a meaningful trip in the East Sea and is learning more about this region. The guys started off at the Daepunghon in Uljin and have now arrived on Ullungdo. What's in store for them in the near future? <laughs>